What's up everybody, Alex here, and welcome to this match of Dota Underlord Standard. We gotta start with the Shaman and the Enchantress. We're gonna get the early Druid bonus, and we are we could go with Savage early, but uh, Nyx Assassin's good. We're gonna grab everybody here. Nyx Assassin's great because he's gonna hit pretty hard um, on his initial vendetta there, but do I want Savage? No, we want Nyx. We want Nyx first. We're gonna just keep everyone back here. We're gonna put Enchantress up front though, because... Enchantress, uh, getting her heal off early will be beneficial. We have a lot of stuff that I can't read. Language that I can't read, anyway. Come on, let's get some luck here. No, that silence might cause problems for us. Come on, keep it up. Keep that heal up. One more chicken. Let's see one more chicken before the cast. Yes, perfect chicken. We're gonna get the win. A good start. A very good start. Oh no, do, do things fall apart here? No, they do not. Good vendetta. Give the crew a hand for the good first round. Good job, guys. Who led in damage? Enchantress, no less, at two stars. With Nyx Assassin's vendetta helping to him uh, to claim second place. Let's see what we get here in the, uh, the item shop here. We are going to go... I like the idea of ability damage. But I want chainmail because I would like to go knights if I can. I keep talking about going knights and I keep not doing knights. So let's see if we can actually do knights. We're gonna go chainmail. We're gonna put chainmail on the enchantress right up front. Look at all these trolls we just got offered. Alright, so we definitely put the trolls on here, don't we? I like the idea of having the vendetta though, but I kind of want the troll bonus. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this. There we go. Look at that. That's not a crazy setup, is it? And we'll grab the two Warlocks just in case we get an easy two-star Warlock just to kind of guide us through the, the first part of the game. Oh, we got some open forwarding! Let's get the horns, guys. He's open forwarding. He's taking damage, but that's okay. He's the only one doing it, so it, it offers him a great advantage because he is not going to be getting the draws. But we got ourselves a dub. All right, so. Okay, so we're getting some early, uh, some early Warlock love here. I'm gonna take Lycan, Shadow Fiend, and I'm gonna just peel off of Razor, I think, right now. No, 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 no. We sell Nyx, pick up Razor, and we're gonna hold on a second. Uh, what I would like to do, again, I'm saying, oh, I'd like to go Knights, and now I'm staring down Druids, Trolls, and Warlocks. Where's this guy fit in? I don't know why I want you, I guess if I decide to go Savage. We're not gonna go savage. Oh, we're gonna get hit with six damage here. You gotta be kidding me. This guy's got some decent RNG going for him. Oh, that makes me sad. Oh well. I need a better crew. I stood no chance in that fight. Let's see what we get in this next shop. If we get two lichens, I'll keep them. Otherwise, I think I'm gonna sell them here. Uh, do we try and go healing and warlocks? That's kind of interesting, isn't it? So this is kind of circumstantial warlock. We have some knights down there. He's two star bad rider. Hmm. I will avenge Mama Eve. We could go healers pretty quick here. Let the all seeing one guide us to victory. What I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna put him over here. Of course I can. Alright. Not going mages here. Do we go knights and healers? Is that kind of the thing we should be doing? It kind of is, isn't it? We have some warlocks here. I was hoping to get a two-star warlock pretty fast. Didn't quite come up. We'll hold on to Snapfire for a sec. Healers and Warlocks are pretty interesting because of the amplification of the healing ability. Uh, that's going to greatly amplify the Warlock synergy. So they kind of do go hand in hand. Um, but they're kind of hard to complete because you only have the Warlock that shares it. Okay, Shadow Shaman. We take it. Now we got two Knights as well. It's going to be great working with you. Okay, we take the level. We take... Our enemies don't have a chance. Time to end All right. this conflict. That's the correct call there. We're not going to re-roll because we don't want to blow up the shop.
Hmm, we gotta keep the two druids on right now. Because that's what RNG gave us. We were blessed with these two-star druids. We're gonna get the dub here. Was this the guy that was open fording? I don't think so. I can't tell the difference. I can't read the words, guys. I cannot read the words. Um, hold on to Snapfire. Do we hold on to Snapfire? No. If we go Knights, we'll want Dragon Knight. So other people are going Knights as well. All right, I'll take Orb. I'm not excited about it, but we'll take it. I'm actually going to put it on Shadow Shaman there. All right, give me a message, Shop. Tell me what you want me to do, Shop. You want me to use the Warlock, and I will. So what we're going to do here is we can't really level up right now. Um, I break up Knights. I put Warlock in. No, I don't break up Knights. I do this. We get the healing bonus. Who's going to do the most damage here? So he has the fastest attack rate, so we'll leave it like that. We got the healing bonus. We have the druid bonus. A little interesting. This is going to get... Oh, he's... No, he's not going to get the silence off. So we're going to get the heal up. There we go. Is the healing going to be enough to sustain us? It is. War, uh, Warlock single target healing is really strong, so it's going to help us here. Um, come on, one more heal, Enchantress. One, no, she went down too early. This is actually going to be closer than I was hoping. Come on, Omni Knight, stay up, stay up. This is going to be tight. It's going to be tight. We're probably going to lose this, it looks like. Take down that axe. Get him. No! Warlock, what are you doing? That is the worst play possible. The worst play possible, Warlock. What have you done? Why must you taunt us like that, Warlock? Oh, uh, two-star draw. It doesn't really make sense. Two-star draw doesn't really make sense. No point in rolling, but we're going to. Give me a second here. What are we looking at? Dazzle! Yes. Now the question is, do we try and roll with Warlocks and Healers? Or do we roll towards Knights and Straight Up Healers? I think we go Knights and Straight Up Healers. As soon as this fight's done, I'm going to take a look at uh, what we've got here on the, the scoreboard. Let's see who's doing what. Come on, one more heal, Enchantress. One more heal, it's clutch. No, Enchantress! And there, Enchantress gets a heal. Of course she does. We're not going to be able to keep up with the pure damage of the Bat Rider, unfortunately. So we're going down. What do we have here? So we have knights on us. We have knights over here. We have knights over here as well. It's hard to tell if he's actually going knights, though. It doesn't appear that way. So I want Dazzle there. So we take the enchantress. We take the Bat Rider. We sell off Venom. We sell off Venom. Hold on to him for a second. We can still okay, that's fine. That's actually not fine. These guys need to be together. Yes. RNG help me. Give RNG a hand. Some bad plays saved by AI. They're like, hey, hey, stupid. Why did you guys split us up? Because now we're not going to get the night bonus. But now we're going to get the night bonus. So their Legion didn't get the kill there, which I'm all about. Let's not feed the Legion, please, because the Legion Commander is so dangerous. It's actually, honestly, it's one of the best builds going right now, easily. Um, we want to replace Warlock, I think, here. But if we can get an early Shadow Shaman at two stars, that does make sense. But we got we have the chance to run four knights. Let's see what our next shop gets. If we get a Shadow Shaman, not a Shadow Shaman, Shadow, Shadow Fiend, then suddenly we have a choice to make. We do not have a choice to make. Because we have Necrophos instead. Um, Necrophos is clutch. We sell off him. We take Necrophos. Find a patient zero. And we wait. Oh, it sucks to not get the guaranteed interest there, but it's okay. It's not a big deal. Interesting split comp here. He's going to poke our healer. He's not going to get the mana regeneration he wants. So now we turned. Oh, and he got the Bloodlust. There we go. There we go. There's the healing that we need. 
We should take this. As long as we can sustain ourselves with the healing. Now, I love getting an Octarine on a 3-star Shadow Shaman. He's not, obviously, he's not guaranteed 3-star right now. But I like what we have going right now. This is good. This is a good win. This is a good win. I'll take it. Okay. I'm honored to fight alongside you. So that was very interesting setup there by Kyle S with the split setup. Uh, it does make sense because none of those units have to be together. What are we looking at here? Friendly fire doesn't make sense. That's more... Oh. Friendly fire doesn't make sense. All auto attacks, not bad. Healing tank, not really what I want. But I'm going to do it. We're going to do healing tank. He okay, so I definitely prefer... I definitely prefer Roundhouse... Uh, Roundhouse Joel, but we're going to take him. Uh, what we're going to do is we're actually going to reposition here. Because we want him to be surrounded by... By guys, the problem is with knights, right? Um, they have to stay together. Do we take Witch Doctor? We'll take Witch Doctor for now. We should start rolling a bit, I think. We have multiple one-star units here. We were fortunate with the Necrophos. Come on, Joel. So, I mean, happy hour works okay, especially with healers. Like, this should be fine. If you're going to run happy hour Joel, this is kind of the time you do it. He's really not the best choice, though. He really isn't. And we're going to lose here because simply um, he has the better comp right now. Friendly fire. Interesting choice of friendly fire there. Friendly fire only truly makes sense. We've got some healers. Yeah, so he's doing a very similar composition as us. We have someone that could carry with kills. Shadow Shaman carrying with kills? Do we Pike Shadow Shaman? Is that just insanity? It is insanity. Pike Shadow Shaman. We're going to give this to the uh, Enchantress. Sven. Sven and Abba. I am the Siren of House Avernus. Dazzle. Sorry, Witch Doctor. You're out. You're out, Witch Doctor. I'm sorry. We're not going to go four trolls. We could. We're close. But if we do four trolls, it's going to be because we have the uh, the Warlord, I think. We're against Kyle S again. I really wish the... Um, I really wish it, it kind of went a little more through the line. We didn't just face the same people all the time. That Doom is going to be problematic for our healers, most certainly. Hopefully we're able to stay up long enough for it to expire. But that Golem hit our Enchantress. That is painful. So that was an absolutely clutch doom. So we're taking another loss. Kyle S just simply beating us. And it's a little unfortunate that we have to keep going against the guy who keeps beating us. But that's the way the RNG rolls sometimes. We're going to take quite a bit of damage here. Eight damage. That's a spicy tamale. We're taking damage here. But we're still A-OK. -okay. It's a little unfortunate that someone is literally doing our exact build. We try so hard to avoid it. And then what happens? It just happens. So now that we're in contested zones here, we need to... We're going to roll here. I'm going to roll. That's what we want. Do I do... No, we don't. We just keep rolling. Yep. Okay. Now... I think we get rid of him as well. Just thinking. If we have these druids, I might want to go um, lone druid. So maybe we go four knights. Is dragon knight the knight we don't use? Dragon knight and troll. No, we want troll, don't we? Maybe chaos knight's the knight we ditch. Decisions have to be made. Kobe here is going to beat us, unfortunately. One more auto attack. Okay, so we saved ourselves two damage here. Now, Treant would benefit from the Healing Alliance. But we have not really seen Treant, have we? There's Io. Io doesn't make a whole lot of sense here. We take the level. I think we just put on another Shadow Shaman, honestly. No. Dazzle. And we will win. Dazzle's the correct choice because it maintains our ability to get a three-star druid. It also allows us to run with the healing alliance. It also gives us the troll alliance bonus. So Dazzle was the correct call there. 
What we really need is a two-star dazzle. And Jewel! Don't die yet! Ah, Jewel, you suck. Why did I pick Jewel? I picked Jewel because I felt like I had no other option. Look how tanky this Snapfire is. Wow, with Vanguard no less. 4k health. She took so much damage. It's a close fight. We're probably going to lose there. That Dragon Knight's going to do work. Are we going to be able to heal ourselves up or what? Oh, that Shadow Shaman's going to get us. Cast. No. Okay, he cast, but it's going to be a little too little too late, unfortunately. It's all right. Kind of expected to lose, honestly. Thinking here. With this team comp, I think I do four Druid here. I think I do four Druid if I can. Of course, Chaos Knight comes into the carousel. Decisions to be made. There is nowhere for them to run. Okay. Bad Rider doesn't make sense. Let's hold on to Shadow Shaman for a minute here. If we can three-star Shadow Shaman, that's great. This is going to guarantee us some, uh, some Druid Synergy. Does Fen even make sense? I have a borderline Legion build with no Legion right now. Come on, happy hour! To your health! Cast it! Jewel, you're so bad! Oh. Happy hour, Jewel. Just constantly disappointing. Constantly disappointing. And we're not going to take those guys out. We're going to take tons of damage here. Not tons, but we're going to take enough damage. Uh, we don't need Viper yet because we don't even have the... Um, we don't even have the Dragon Knight yet, so... There's Chaos Knight. We take it. I have a Chaos Knight. I won't be made a fool of this time. Is it too late to pick up Legion Commander? Is it too late to pick up Legion Commander? It is too late. Round 15, too late for Legion Commander. Come on, Joel, stop sucking. Come on, Joel, do something. And our Enchantress, three-star Enchantress, just did not get her heal off. Guys, we are in trouble. We're in trouble here. That's a spicy loss. My noble house will stand. Hmm. Hmm. Targeting buddy over on this side. Oh, there, there's a two-star dazzle. Okay, that's helpful. Certainly helpful. There's okay, there's a lone druid. Nature will come to my aid. Will it? I will bow to no one. Alright. We can pull this off. I know it. Alright, so. Druids. Knights. Healers. Savage is just a bonus that I don't intend on keeping. But I felt like we had to level there in order to kind of start winning because we were taking too much damage. And I don't want to take too much damage. Also, Lone Druid does make sense. Ideally, I think we do four Druid here. We need Treant. We've not gotten a Treant yet. Is Treant being contested? Who's it? Like, I don't even see a Treant on this board. Am I just blind? Is Treant not here? Is, is he just not in the shop? Did he get rotated out? So, if we run Treant, four knights is the max. Can't re-roll here. Who do we protect here? We protect... We'll do this. Let's do this team. No way, I just took the item off. That was embarrassing. It was embarrassing. Trying to give it to Dazzle. 
That dazzle DPS, that's what I'm after right now. Alright, good cast there. Good shield on the uh, the Chaos Knight. That certainly helps. Oh, look at this. That's not good. That's not good at all. We got a bear who's not bearing. We got a bear who's not mauling. There we go. Get out there, bear. Come on. Entangle him before he casts? No! Abaddon survived, thankfully. Beat up on that Anessix. There it is. There's a good win. There's a good win. Alright, we're starting to turn things around a bit. Everyone's kind of in the same spot. We're still, like, lower mid-pack, but... We're okay. We're okay. It's not too crazy. Not getting, uh... Not getting too nervous yet. Okay, Sven... Sven sucks. We hold on to the Abba. We roll here. Okay, we take Necro. I would have loved to pull to 8. I like to pull to 8 when possible when you see this kind of, uh, when you see 5 of 35. I love to get to 8 because that means you can only cleanly get to 8 5 rounds from now. That would be level 23. That's not what I'm interested in. But really, if we can continue to economy intelligently, we only have a 1 star, um, well we have 1 star Necrophos and 1 star Lone Druid. Come on, this is a guy that we should be able to beat. We're a healing alliance, and he's spreading out damage like crazy. We should be able to beat this guy. But we're not going to. He's going to beat us. He's just got more value. He's simply got more value. That's a ton of damage, too. Very unfortunate. We're close to... 3-star Shaman. Close to 3-star Abba now. Still no Tree and Protector. The Chaos Knight is here. Your loyalty to me will be rewarded There's Tree and with victory. I don't like doing that, but I have no choice. Now we try and get to Abe. We're also very close to a 3-star Abaddon, which is wonderful. That's exactly what we want. Now we try and get to 8. We need that Knight bonus up front with Abaddon. Finally got the Treant. It's not going to be enough though. I think this guy's going to beat us, unfortunately. We're not going to be able to do enough here. Oh no, you entangled my targeting buddy! How dare you! How cruel can you be? At least we're gonna take minimized damage here. Uh, is there a chance that we win? No, there really shouldn't be a chance that we win here. What's he throwing with? He's throwing straight fire, lone druid. Good night. Five damage, that is spicy tamale. Now we're gonna be able to get to level 8, which is great. But I still, oh, but getting, blowing that man, that, that money, oh, we're so close. Come on. We try and survive for one more. There it is. I'm glad I did that. I'm glad I did that. All right. Here we go, 3-star Abba. That should make a difference for us. That targeting buddy took tons of damage there. Come on, Joel. Get that happy hour cast. Let's see it. We need it. We need it, Joel. Let's see it. Treant's healing. There we go. That's a win. That's what we needed. That's a win. There it is. Good. Alright, so now what we're going to do is we're going to level, we're going to get Chaos Knight back in. We want Abaddon to have that Knight bonus. I think we just roll with these. Unfortunately, I, I, we don't do Dragon Knight. Yeah, we just roll these two Knights right now. I, I would have loved Omni Knight. Diffusal Blade. <laughs> like, who's a good target for, I guess, I guess Lone Druid? Not a great target for Diffusal Blade, that's for sure. 
Another Shadow Shaman. I noticed, Mr. Shadow Shaman, so we're one away for you. Uh, we're gonna level. I will not lose what I've built. He needs to be centralized. Because he heals. We switch these two. No. Okay. They won't stop us. Let's see how we do here. We're so wide in our in our line synergies here. That's gonna work out pretty well. We have the knight bonus. Abaddon's gonna get an early cast here. It's on Treant, which is beneficial. Oh, our Abaddon's entangled. Come on, Abba. Wakey, wakey. Get another cast. There we go. There we go. Things are starting to starting to roll here. Now, Omni Knight would have been a great pairing, unfortunately. As a, like, I really regret not running Omni Knight. We should be running Omni Knight over Chaos Knight. It's a shame we were against a ghost. We would have hit that guy for like 20 damage. I, it almost makes me want to pick up Omni Knights if I can. But look, we're just being offered Chaos Knights. So I roll for Shadow Shaman here. Ooh. Can't put him in right now. Can't put him in. Shadow Shaman. Okay. Pains me to have to do that. But now we're guaranteed multiple three... Uh, well, we still have a one-star lone druid which holds us back. But now druids, they're giving us some value here. No, my Abaddon! Stay up, Abaddon. Stay up, stay up. No! Abaddon is so valuable to us. But now that we have the healing going, we got the tanking going, now suddenly Happy Hour Joel makes a little more sense. We're going to hit this guy pretty hard here. Okay, 17. So now we were in the lower middle of the pack, but now we're starting to do something here. Okay, oh, look at that. Okay, we're heating up a little bit. Let's give ourselves a hand. We're doing it, yeah. You hold your wine glass. Is that a wine glass? It kind of looks like a wine glass. We're going to continue to roll here. We're looking for that Shadow Shaman. There's Omni Knight. I'm going to hold on to Omni Knight. Simply out of sheer regret. Another Omni Knight. Now we can't roll, though. Okay. I wanted to make that decision because I wanted that roll, and I would have sold Chaos Knight if I saw a shot of Shaman. Um, realistically, Omni Knight, if he's at 2-star, he goes in for Chaos Knight. Because the healing amplification is too valuable. Simply too valuable. All right, that's a pretty good that's pretty good positioning for us there. Treant's gonna be able to get a lot of healing for us. Not the that's not a good Abaddon shield. That's not who we want shielded. There we go. All right, so things are going pretty good now. We're starting to turn this around. We're gonna hit this guy pretty hard. We're probably gonna hit him for close to 20 damage. All right, there we go. Oh, I wish we eliminated him. That would have been great. I'm all about getting in the points. Give our team a hand, guys. They're turning it around. Kobe don't pass. Still problematic for us, but... All right, come on. That three-star Shadow Shaman would be so money because then it guarantees another three-star Druid. Okay, so that works too. If we can get another lone Druid, we can. Oh, look at this lineup here. We take the lone Druid. We don't actually lock. We don't actually lock because at two stars, we're going to be putting in Omni Knight. Um, I think we keep the formation as we have it right now. So now we're going to have multiple three stars here. If we only had him, we'd have three three star druids. And that would make all the difference for us. We're against Kyle S. Kyle S has been beating up on us all game. Let's see how we do here against Mr. Kyle S. Abaddon, look at that. 4k in damage there. Suddenly, Kyle, your team don't look so spicy now, does it? An excellent win. There we go, guys. That's awesome. Look at this. Hey, we got a five streak going. I am on fire. I am on fire, guys. We got work going. Guys are getting knocked out like crazy. We are top four. We're in the points. Here we go. We have turned this game around. Totally turned this game around. We're still hunting for that Shadow Shaman. We'll take the Omni Knight. Omni Knight in. Uh, we're going to sell off the Chaos Knight. 
Shadow Shaman! Things are working for us now, guys. Now we're on to something. Let's take a look at some of the positioning here. Uh, that is... Okay, let's assume we're going against Kobe Don't Pass, and we got it! Okay, I'm glad I made that quick switch. No, we're not! That didn't work. Oh well, it's okay. He's doing the right thing though, he's pulling our knights off the line. Now we should be able to beat this guy. Ooh, that assassinate on the treant, that's a big, that's a big loss. There we go. Okay, that helps our healers now. This is gonna be closer than it should be, but it looks like we got a bit of an edge here, because, uh... Hopefully the assassinate, okay, no, so I was hoping that assassinate hits Abaddon because Abaddon would have just ate it So we're gonna beat this guy. We're gonna knock him out. We are still on fire We're in the third place already guys. Here we go. Kobe don't pass taking the loss. We know we can beat Kyle Are we gonna take the dub here? This is incredible because I it was looking really bad for us at one point We take Vlad's here. Vlad's on our Omni Knight um, We got to keep these two together. Ideally you'd want hold on Hold on. What if we do this? We know that Kobe's on the edge. Hmm. We hold on to our money right now and we ramp up. Because um, we're not really looking for anyone. He's split. I think we do this, in case we get him. If we get Kyle S, we want to be split. We got Kyle S! So now, we're gonna have to... So that he's gonna deal with these guys, while we stomp these guys. That works! It helps keep our Jewel alive, at least a little bit now. He's got tons of armor. Look at Jewel's armor, plus 26. That's a lot of armor. They're not gonna do enough damage to him. We got Kyle S! You're getting eliminated, Mr. Kyle S, because you got O-positioned, my friend. As soon as he saw me switch that uh, that taunt, that targeting buddy, he should have made a change. We're going to hit this guy for a ton of damage. Is he eliminated? He is! And Kobe Don't Pass almost got eliminated by us too, but he's still in it. Alright, now we get to match up directly with Kobe Don't Pass. Um, do we economy to nine? Because who are we rolling for? We roll. We take whoever we can here, and then we'd be smart about it. Or we're just gonna waste all our money. We're gonna waste all our money. That's fine. I should've just set up... Um... Nope! I didn't let go, because I want... Treant there. I wish I positioned him a little better, but Treant... It's key Treant's there, because he's gonna heal everyone within one cell. That is super important. Ah, he moved away anyway, so he's not even healing anybody. But we should beat him. We're on fire. Are we going to beat Mr. Kobe? It looks like we got him. He simply cannot keep up with our druids, our healers, our knights, our savages, our druids, our trolls, <laughs> and our heartless. We got the dub, guys. It's victory for us. What a match. That makes me so excited because, guys, we were... Totally gonna lose that. We were on pace for like an 8th place finish, and we totally swig, uh, swung things around a little bit. Come on, I want to see the stats. We totally changed the game. We were we tried to be as flexible as possible. We were running the weirdest build for a while in the middle while we found ourselves, and then we did it, and we got the dub. Guys, thank you so much for watching, and a very special thank you to all of my wonderful subscribers. Take care, everyone, and have yourselves a wonderful day.